Executive Mayor of the City of Shwane, Silias Brink, has dismissed the motion of no confidence brought against him by the ANC in city stating that the ANC is struggling to adjust to their position in the opposition. On Friday, the ANC's regional branch in Shwane held a media briefing where they outlined their plan to remove Brink through a motion of no confidence which is said to be presented in the council. In an interview with Newsroom Africa on Monday, Brink remarked that the ANC in Shwane has not undergone any significant reform. He contended that the current effort to dispose the DA-led coalition that governs Shwane is driven by new measures aimed at curbing corruption, particularly in relation to gender processes. Brink explained in Daikot, I believe this motion is motivated by the new performance standards we have introduced for waste removal contracts. There are suspicion that the regional secretary of the ANC has vested interest in some of the water subcontractors. The MMC for Finance, Jackie, has even lodged a statement with the police regarding this matter. End of quote. In addition, former waste collection contractors in Shwane have been accused of sabotaging service delivery, adding another layer of the ongoing political drama. Brink also emphasized his commitment to leading the Metro post elections and addressed the resignation of former Shwane Mayor Randall as a DEA councillor highlighting the continuous challenges faced by the city's administration. Brink further criticized the ANC in Shwane for their inconsistent role as an opposition party. He said, and I quote, They do not issue these statements or criticism in a regular, coherent manner. These attacks seem to come out of nowhere, usually once or twice a year. Even as our financial indicators show improvement, our new top management works to change the city's institutional culture and remake progress at the Roy Wall Water Treatment Works. End of quote. He went on to say that the ANC has not presented a viable plan for governing the city of Shwane. Eugene Modise, the ANC regional chairperson, announced that the motion of no confidence against Brink would be tabled later in the week. This political maneuver comes at a time when the city is striving to stabilize and improve its governance structures. Last year, after a period of political instability, Silius Brink, a DA councillor, was elected as the city of Shwane's new executive mayor. In his acceptance speech, Brink committed to establishing a corruption-free administration aimed at enhancing the lives of all Shwane residents. The motion of no confidence and the allegations surrounding it highlighting the ongoing political tension in Shwane. The ANC's attempt to unseat Brink is seen by some as a response to the stringent measures the current administration has taken against corruption, particularly in awarding the tenders. Moreover, the allegation that the ANC's regional secretary may have interest in sub contracting companies bring to light potential conflicts of interest that could be influencing the political landscape. The situation underscores the challenges faced by the current administration as they attempt to implement reforms and improve services delivery in the city.